This is the Iron Trader, and this is Midday Trading. Today, we're going to take a look here at the VIX, V-I-X, the Volatility Index. This video is for information purposes only, not a recommendation to buy, sell any stock, not the ETF. Please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. All right, here we have the old VIX, your daily and your weekly chart. Now, as that market is going up here and up here and up here, you're only going to sustain it for so long, as we can see today. Okay, so yesterday we had um, uh, Microsoft come out and Google come out. They had really, really good numbers, but they weren't like the over the top numbers. A lot of that price is built right into these stocks. Okay, so today we have the Fed meeting. Um, I think they're going to leave everything as is, uh, but the key is you want to listen to the language on what they use going forward. That's going to be the key. And then Thursday is going to be a big day for technology because you got Amazon and you got Apple and you got Meta. So you're going to have some huge, huge volatility. Now, again, Microsoft and Google didn't make the number. I mean, they made the numbers, but they weren't exceeding everything to a max. So it could be a real big shakeout. So let's take a look at the VIX here and see what we have. Well, <clears throat> you can see where we came all the way down here to this 11 81 and then what you have here this is the same as a stock see you had a higher low a higher low a higher low okay and then we had higher high higher high higher high okay so this pattern is basically setting up the bust higher which means the market will come down lower now we had a high up here when you look at this price channel going right across of um uh, 1540 now we had a retest here last week uh 1535 uh, so that was that double top and it came right on down now you can see today we have that big green candle again here so what you're looking at here is uh today's high was 1437 so again the next level here we could do is we can come up to here where you have uh 1449 um right there you have 1458 then we can come up to the candle at 1489 and then your big retest there is at 1540 now we do have your two, uh, 100 sma here uh at 1498 and we have your 200 day uh sitting there uh at uh, 1524. uh so you always want to watch those two but the breakout is going to be this price channel uh right there at 1540. now again if you can exceed that then what we do is we just go to the left of your chart here. So what we're looking at is then we have a target up here at 16.62. And then we look to the candle, the bottom of this candle, you're looking at 17.97. And then the top, you're looking at 18.42. And then we'll look to the bottom of this candle, which you're looking at uh, 19.72. And uh, then we look to the top of this candle here, 19.86. And then we'll come to the top of this candle. You're looking at 2116. And then your retest here is 2207, which is basically your price channel. And then your big boy up there is 2308. Now, if this thing spiked up to that level there, then, you know, your market is going to come selling off here very, very hard. Now, here on the downside, what we're looking for here is we're looking for everything that's jammed up in this area. So you're basically looking at that 1340. That's going to be key. And then you have your uh, 1306 and then your 1235 is going to be your retest. Uh, but I do like this pattern here of the series of higher uh, uh, highs and higher lows. That's always a very bullish pattern. Now, when we look here on the old weekly chart, well, what do we got? Well, here's that double candle, okay? So that's that 1540, and then we have the retest uh, here this week here of uh, uh, 1535. So that's that double top that's in play. Now, again, if you can go above that, we have that 1594, then you have 2019, 2160 uh, a nine, and then your big retest up there at 2308. So now you can see where the VIX uh, here on this, where you have a high, lower high lower high lower high and that's the same way here see how it's sold right on off but if this is a nice good bottoming pattern that is going on here now so again the vix here if this spikes higher will take these markets down much much lower so we just remember we want to listen to the fed today to see what they have to say very very critical and then we want to also listen to the um uh earnings calls here 
for Amazon, for Apple, and for Meta here on Thursday. That's going to be a real tell. Now, today is the last day of the month, or usually today is a sell day anyway, okay? Uh, and then usually new money will come in, okay, into the uh, uh, stock market here at the beginning of the month. So, again, if Amazon, Apple, and Meta have good numbers here, you could take this VIX rate right back on down here and maybe even retest at 1235 uh, or even hold that 1340. Again, if the numbers come out and they say, oh, they're, they're in line and bad thing, but they're just not blowing it away, then you could exceed this. So obviously what you want to watch is this 1540. If that 1540 is exceeded, then we just follow right on up here, which you can retest that 2308 very, very easily here. So you have to stay really sharp between today and tomorrow. Okay, this is what I got for you on the old VIX.